the collection. And my once in my caboodle video, a lot of you guys requested me to do an updated pop socket collection. So if you haven't seen that, I store all my pop sockets in my blue caboodle. I also got some new ones. I can't wait to show you what they look like. So let's get started. Before I show you what's inside my caboodle, my order from Pop Sockets just came in, so I'm going to show you what they look like. Let me just grab all of them. This one here is a Hello Kitty Sanrio License Pop Socket. There's a few more that you can choose from, but I decided to choose this Hello Kitty sitting on a rainbow. It's so adorable. Then I have this Sprinkle Pop Socket. It's pink, and I can't wait to find a case for it. It's super colorful, too. Then this one is my most favorite. This is the Crystals from Swarovski Pop Socket. This is the Alabaster one, and the crystals on here are an opaque pink, but I really like it because it's a true pink. In the last collection, the crystals were clear and more sparklier. There's two other colors that you can choose, but obviously I got rose. Now let me show you the rest of my Pop Socket. When you open up my caboodle, you see these two trays. So this one here has my merch Pop Sockets, and I just have three of them. This is my official merch pop socket, but these two I just designed myself. I like how this one has a purple font, but this one just has a floral backing. I also have some of my merch phone cases, since I didn't know where to put them. This one here just says Jessalyn Grace, and this just has like an empty background so that you can put your pop socket on here, which is great, and it also has my merch pop socket. So let's just put that back real quick. In this compartment, I have my loose pop socket. I couldn't find the um, packaging for this one. The reason why it's all white and plain is because I was going to decorate it, but I didn't have time to do that yet. And I also have some backings. Since I'm using two pop sockets right now, um, I just stored these so that when I'm not using it, I can just put it back. And this protects the adhesive. Now on to my fancy pop sockets. So this one here is my diamond pop socket. It's one of my favorites. This is in rose gold. I also have this twist aluminum edition. And what's cool about this one is that when you, you know, put it on the middle of your phone, it can spin. So like you can just face it down on a flat surface and spin it like a spinner. <laughs> I also have this teal or like bluish green diamond pop socket as well and this color is pretty oh and i also i have this magenta one then i have this twist aluminum edition pop socket um i have the silver one like i showed you but this is in the color rose gold so i was doing my back to school shopping i wanted to look at the pop sockets and i saw that they had the rose gold one so i decided to pick it up then i have this lavender purplish diamond pop socket and I love this color as well. This one here is an online exclusive. This is another pop socket that I found at Target. And if you didn't notice, some of the new pop sockets, now it has, you know, their logo on here, which is pretty cool. This is really nice and is iridescent. It has like this snake skin pattern. It's not made of real snake skin, but I love the feeling of it. And like I said, it's super pretty. Oh, and I also have this metallic Safiano pop socket. This has like a leather texture, you know, like um, the same texture as a purse, but I'm not so sure if it's made out of real leather. I got this in gold, and I also found this at Target. Oh, and finally, I have this Crystals from Swarovski pop socket. This is from the previous collection where the crystals were more clear and sparkly, so I'm going to do a comparison between these two right now. So the new one here has um, an opaque pink crystals, and then the old one, which is sold out, it has clear crystals. But they're basically the same with the rose gold rim. The older version, which isn't the alabaster, it's more shimmery. So let me know in the comments down below which one you think looks good. All right, now it's time to show you guys the rest of my pop sockets. First, I have this Galaxy pop socket. It's really nice, and I actually have a matching phone case for this. I picked up this unicorn pop socket from Claire's and I love how it has some unicorns with this really pretty color combo which is blue, pink, and purple. And I also have this donut one. Um, it looks like an actual donut 
It looks so good, by the way. And it's just a pink donut with a bunch of colorful sprinkles. This pop socket here I got at Justice, and it just has a mermaid, also some seashells, fish, and a seahorse. Oh, and this isn't a pop socket, it's just so cute, I had to have it. This is a stand-up spy casemate, and it's in the shape of a balloon dog. I wouldn't find this practical, though, because it's not like a pop socket where you can just push it down. It's permanently like this, and the only way to take it out of your phone is, you know, to pull it, and it has a suction cup on here, but this is still pretty cute. Oh, and I also picked up this pop socket from Justice. It has a bunch of emojis, and then my initial, which is a J. I also have this Pokemon Pop Socket, which my dad needs for a while, but I took it back, and it's just a Pokeball on here. This is another Diamond Pop Socket. I got this in the color black, and the reason why it's in here and not with the rest of my fancy Pop Sockets or Diamond Pop Sockets is because this scratched a lot, and I still want to, you know, keep it and reuse it again, but I'm planning on painting it, you know, gold or spray painting it black again. I'm not so sure, but I just kept this. Then this is another pop socket from Justice. It just has an emoji, which is spitting out rainbows. <laughs> Next, this was given to me as a gift. It's a customized pop socket, and on it, it has a bunch of desserts or sweets. So it has like some ice cream, cupcakes, and all of that, but I love how it has a bunch of kawaii faces on it. Then I have this pop socket, which was also a gift given to me. This is a customized pop socket as well, and on it, it just has these three gorgeous girls. I love the gorgeous girls. I think it's so cute, and my mom thinks that it kind of looks like me. Do you think so? <laughs> and finally, I have this pop socket here, and um, I actually have the matching phone case to this. This is the same print as one of my Velvet Caviar phone cases, which is pretty cool, so I just have that. That's pretty much it. I hope you enjoyed this video. And just a disclaimer, I did not go out and buy all these five seconds at once, because if I did, that would be pretty expensive. But when you want to start a collection, you need to learn how to take care of yourself and try to find ways to earn money to expand it. And if you're wondering why I haven't used any of my pop sockets, I actually have just like some of the new ones, you know, because I just got them. I always like to keep the packaging, and it's actually good to keep the packaging since it has an extra adhesive. So when your pop socket isn't sticky anymore, you can just put it on. But I always keep it, and I put the pop socket back when I'm not using it. It's just an OCD of mine. Yeah, I always like how it's neat, and it kind of seems new. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Also turn on post notifications so you won't miss any videos from me. And if you haven't already done so, please follow me on all my social medias. I have Instagram and Musical.ly. Well, actually now it's called TikTok. But um, both usernames are the same for those so two social medias. It'll be on the screen right here. Underscore Jessalyn Grace underscore. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!